It's new car day. Let's do this. Ladies and gentlemen, Jason Andrews, AKA the All-American Driver. Welcome back to the channel. It is so nice to see you guys. And yes, it's true. I bought a Tesla Model Y Performance. that the next normal car I buy was going to be electric. Love it or hate it, that's just where we're at right now. For me, for a daily driver, it doesn't get much better than this. I know a lot of you guys know me out there from my Ford Mustang Shelby GT350R, and you might be asking yourself, Jason, why didn't you get the Ford Mustang Mach-E? for a couple reasons. One, the Model Y performance is faster, and obviously that's like the most important thing. Two, it really is kind of annoying how Ford is limiting the power output for the Mach-E to only five second intervals. I cannot understand that, just let me do what I want with the car. Three, the rear hatch and storage on the Model Y is so much more efficient. I love the rear entry of the hatch and it's just low enough that it's easy for my dogs to get in and out of the back of the Tesla. And last but not least, track mode. Now obviously being an electric car, it's insane how smooth and quiet this thing is on the road. But don't let that confuse you because this is a 500 foot pound of torque, 450 horsepower crossover SUV that does zero to 60 in three and a half seconds. Yeah, it's fast. <laughs> the interior is simple, minimalist, yet sophisticated. The seats are very comfortable and the screen is incredibly responsive. The panoramic glass roof gives the cabin a nice airy feel. And honestly, because of how tinted it is, it doesn't even get that hot, even in Florida. Styling is fine on this car. I actually like the look of the Model Y. Compared to the standard model, the performance has got 21 inch wheels, which I'll probably be swapping out. It's got different brakes. It sits a tad lower. It's got way more horsepower and torque. We've even got a baby carbon fiber spoiler. How cute. Another thing I like about the Tesla um, and just kind of EVs in general is the one pedal drive. I mean, there are days where I'm driving this thing all over and I don't hit the brake pedal once. It's, it's actually really nice. One thing I've got to get used to is whenever you hit the turn signals, it pops up on the screen, that camera on the side that you're turning. It is, um, it's been quite the challenge not to like continuously just like look over, but honestly using the blinker, the screen pops up you really don't have to. Did I mention how fast this thing is? I'm, <laughs> I'm not exaggerating. This thing turns my stomach. This thing like pushes all the blood <laughs> into the back of my head. This thing is very fast, you know? If I was just to do that over and over again, honestly, it would make me a little bit sick. 20 miles an hour, 30, 50, it's, it's insane. It is insane, the torque, the, the power. <laughs> ah, and it's so quiet and there's not a big commotion about the thing. It's just like, oh, where do you want to go? There, boom, and you're there. <laughs> it's, ah, oh, wow, that's crazy. It's really crazy. And you know, being a, you know, being an EV, this thing weighs quite a bit, um, but all of the weight is in its batteries and all the batteries are at the bottom. They're at the floorboard. So center of balance, center of gravity, this thing actually handles really well. What do we have here? My all-star wife, 40 weeks pregnant, digging into the trash. <laughs> what are you doing? I've worked during 
something <laughs> for us. Now I'm gonna go ahead and smash this accelerator pedal for you so you can see how fast this car is. But before I do that, smash the like button, smash the subscribe button. Here we go, three, two, Now with an unlimited budget, I probably would have went for the Porsche Taycan Turbo S Cross Turismo. However, I really couldn't justify or afford buying a $200,000 electric car, especially if I'm just using it as a daily driver. Overall, I'm pumped. I have been driving this thing for the past couple weeks and it has been great, especially since I got the 240 outlet installed in the garage. I mean, this thing charges in just a couple hours. Here in Jacksonville, they offer a lot of incentives and rebates for driving an electric car. Now I have already enrolled in these programs and I am basically getting free charging as long as I charge at night, easy. So that's it, my Tesla Model Y performance. Now I've got some ideas, I've got some plans, I've got a direction I wanna take this car, but so far I have been loving the electric lifestyle. You know what, it's actually kind of funny, I have got a petrol engine car, a diesel engine car, and now I've got an electric vehicle. So that's it for me. The kid will be arriving very, very soon. It could be any day, it could be any minute now. Basically, I'm on standby with Andrea to, you know, to go into labor, to rush, to get to the hospital. Very excited, but very nervous also. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you guys for smashing that like button. Jason Andrews, the All-American Driver. I will see you guys in the next episode.